Well, let's talk about football and the big NFL news from the weekend. Julio Jones is a Tennessee Titan. You see it right there. It's been big around the league. Chris Harris is here now. And Chris, I heard it, it was just a different <laughs> vibe when that news was announced. Yeah, I mean, you see it on Twitter Sunday morning. And you're like, holy smokes, yes. how about that? Now, what it signifies, though, is that Titans general manager John Robinson believes that this team win, this team's window to win a Super Bowl is now. You take on a $15.3 million salary that you have to juggle some numbers to afford you're going all in, right? And that's what the Titans are doing by adding the future NFL Hall of Famer to the mix. And that offense, you know, has the potential to be a beast because of it. But remember, J-Rob's never been afraid to make bold moves to try to help the team. Sometimes it's worked, sometimes it hasn't. But this is a team who's had a winning record every year since Robinson took over because of his decisions. When we got a chance to shoot, we shoot. And, um, and we felt like this was was a move where we need to pull the trigger. You're never going to be 100% right um, in this job. No GM is in, in any sport. Like you're going to miss sometimes. You never put the gun away. You keep you keep firing at it. And if, if it works, um, you know, you're, you're lauded. If you're not, they're ready to run you out of town. That's what we signed up for. That is the name of the game. Now, here are a few of the tidbits of Julio's resume. He's already got more 100-yard receiving games than all Titans receivers have ever had. He's been elite for a decade, and even last year when he played in just nine games because of a hamstring issue, he still went for 771 yards. And now, of course, Julio's got one of the best QBs in the league throwing in the ball. Yeah, I'm talking about Ryan Tannehill. He does not get nearly the love that he deserves. In fact, at 630, we'll show you the numbers that back that up, Marius. The only number we need to see is number 11, Julio <laughs> Jones in Nashville. Chris, thanks.